Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, are now happily married after their spectacular royal wedding in May 2018. However, their relationship with Meghan's father Thomas Markle SNR became strained just before their marriage, when he became embroiled in a series of staged paparazzi photos. Since then, Mr. Markle has made a number of attacks on the royal couple in the media. His latest barb came this month as he released scans of a personal letter from the Duchess in a move that is reportedly worried the Queen. Royals podcast from Australian magazine New Idea, here's from royal experts Zoe Burrell and Angela Mollard. Ms. Mollard said, the fact that there's no immediate resolution in sight, I think, would be terribly worrying for the Queen. Her apparent comment on it is that it is nightmare. The comment was reported by well respected royal correspondent Katie Nichol, who wrote, She told them both that the whole thing was becoming a nightmare and that they should try and sort things out. Ms. Mollard commented, The Queen has just had the family operating well, all on message, all marrying well. Now Harry's gone and married someone who has a history that is bringing difficulties to the family. Dot she added, the monarchy in some respects is always vulnerable. It's an institution that relies on public opinion. The Queen needs it to be cohesive, needs it to be functioning, for people to be acting appropriately. She's spent her lifetime working towards stability. It must be incredibly dispiriting. Dot however, Ms. Mollard also said she had a sympathy for the Duchess of Sussex and shared her opinion that Thomas Markle SNR was at fault. She said, at the end of the day I genuinely believe it's the parents' responsibility to determine the relationship with their child, not the child's responsibility. Thomas Markle is failing her on every count. The comments come after Meghan Markle's New York City baby shower, which she held on Wednesday. The Queen is said to disapprove of the American baby shower tradition and reports circulated that the Duchess of Sussex was defying royal protocol. Channel 7 reporter Peter Ford said, There may be some tone of disapproval about this because there are reports going around that the royal family don't approve of baby showers and she is defying them by going to New York and spending time with her close friends.